Happy New Year, everybody. James Stavolsky here for EA Sports. I know my broadcast partner, Ray Ferraro, has already broken his resolutions. Let's see what both teams have in store on the ice tonight. Well, we've been waiting for this one all day long, and here we go. Puck is dropped. Let's do this hockey. Pass broken up. Blazing in on the breakaway. Wow, score! And that's how you kick off a new year. The Sharks with a quick strike have essentially shushed the crowd here. Man, there's people not in their seats yet, James. They're just coming in through the aisles into their seats, and it's already 1-0. And play resumes as the puck is dropped. There's a collision with some authority. Oh, the athletic therapist is already waiting for him at the door. He got crushed on that hit. He needs some help. Lundqvist's going to cover it up and get a whistle. Even with the traffic starting to close in, he had to grab that when he did. That one stung, and he's slow to get himself back together here, James. I want to look at that again. Still early on in this frame, James and Ray with you. So glad you could join us. San Jose's ahead, 1-0. Nice start winning the draw here inside the offensive zone. Hurdle's going to hear it from the crowd for the rest of the night. He caused that er earlier injury to the home team player, and they're not very happy with him. Quebec's got the puck in the road end. Exploring options here inside the defensive zone. And that pass doesn't go. Receives the pass. And that pass can't connect. Into the offensive zone. Sets it in front. It scores! What an opportunity! It delivers! How you'd expect that. The team's leading goal scorer finishes another one. Nolan's not going to be able to return to the game. Just got word from the PR department. He's out for the night. All right, thanks very much for the update, Mr. Ferraro. And we'll see how things are impacted here with the line juggling going forward. And a little physical there with that collision. Yeah, after the teammate got hurt, he jumped right in. He's going to make him try and pay a price. We got ourselves a fight here. That had a whole lot of nasty, and it all seemed to be tilted in one way. Uh, pretty quickly, you could see there was an upper hand to be had in that fight. That's the way it played out. Now, you can't touch momentum, but you can feel it. And the home team's going to build a little bit, they believe, after a fight win. Listen to this place. Clark's won the draw deep in the defensive zone. Carlson's got it along the boards. Sends the puck across. Nabokov's on top of that for the whistle. Pretty quickly on top of it to kill the play. Always a little awkward playing your former team for the first time. I'll tell you one thing. When you go say hi at the end of the game, you want to have the upper hand on your old buddies. Quebec's got it, and they're on the attack. Taken along the wall by Clark. Quebec's going to play the puck from behind the cage. San Jose's got control of it now from their own end. Gets the puck in deep. Here in the corner, he grabs the puck. Hammers it from the point. Denies him again. Goalie coaches are always working on following and tracking the puck. He stopped one. Now you got to stop the second. Quebec sliding the puck behind the net. Looks to set up at the point now. Cuts to the paint. Directs it on over to Hensus. Poked away at center by Gretzky. San Jose's got it along the wall. Along the boards, they battle for the puck back and forth. Moves the pass in front. Couldn't complete the pass. Quebec's got the puck along the wall. Here he is from the slot. How did he stop that one? Oh! Well, James, 
you run around like that, you're going to have to pay the price eventually. And what that means is you're going to have to fight. Here he goes. Good old-fashioned Donnybrook here. Somebody came third in that fight. That was decisive. Solani's greatest asset is his speed. His wheel zone ability means he can really fly when he's got the space to move. Gretzky's got that third eye zone ability, which means he's fantastic at making those difficult passes to create the perfect chance for his teammates. Now, as I send it back upstairs, I'll be watching out for one of these players to give their team a chance to win tonight. To his teammate! Nice defensive robbery with the stick. Nabokov's gonna hang on to that one for a whistle. Quickly on top of that, James, he needed a cover there. Nylander's been on fire lately. His point streak's starting to stretch out. This is when you feel like you'll score any game. Gretzky's won the draw here in the offensive zone. There's the whistle as the puck goes out of play. Solani's been looking for the door here to get off the ice after he was injured in the middle of this ship. Late goings of this period. The next goal could be a big one as we are tied. San Jose's got possession here in their own end. Handles the pass from the oh, right side. Man. That's generally a no-fly zone with star players. Yeah, they get hit like that. Somebody's going to get irritated, and guess what happens when they get irritated? Down go the mitts. Go time. And hanging on for dear life, and this one comes to an end. That doesn't feel any, very good either when you get dropped onto the ice like that. It's, it's going to hurt a little bit, probably less than getting punched in the face, though. Not much doubt who the winner is of this fight. Watch it, and now listen. And the crowd back alive here inside the stadium. Action set to resume here after what was a wild couple of minutes on the ice there. Puck grab by Boyle. Poked away in the neutral zone by Gretzky. Here's the pass. Puts it in for the go-ahead goal. Control the game now. You finally got the lead. You worked so hard to get in front. Don't give it up now. This isn't somebody just thinking about controlling the puck and holding it for possession. He knows by holding it, somebody's going to get open. If he can just hang on to it long enough, there's going to be an open player. He does it, and it leads to the goal. Perfectly played. Teams are ready to go, and we're about moments away from puck drop. Gains possession with both centers all tied up in the draw. And called to the offside. We'll get a faceoff. He was waiting for him and laid the shoulder right into him. That might loosen a few of the choppers on that play. And with that, the first period comes to an end. Both teams will have a chance to get a breather, and they'll be back on the ice with period number two in not too long. Thanks for that, Ray. Let's see how the coach rolls with that now. Well, after an intriguing opening period, here we go. It's period number two. Puck is dropped, and we are underway. Great for all's between the benches. Razor, give me a sense of how you see things so far. San Jose is looking to overcome that slow start. They just didn't have it early. And by the time their legs started to come around, they were chasing the game. The second period gives them a new opportunity. 
Goes right to the crease. Scores! The captain comes through! All this technical practice, and then it only gets to the point where it's just a last-ditch effort. Whatever you can try to try and keep the puck out of the net. He lays it out there, but it's just not enough, and that'll end up as a goal against. Lots of time left in this period. Quebec's got a two-goal lead. They'd love to build on it. Race for the puck here. Icing waved off on the play. Manages to hang on. Puck picked up by Richard. Let's it go. Scores! James, you might as well put both goalies in the other net there. That's four in a row for him. Once he sees the open player, He's going to zip that puck. His firm, crisp passes are easy to handle. Quebec's on a roll tonight. They extend the lead here in the second. Everything they do is better than the other team tonight. This is a domination performance. And with the centers tied up, he swoops in to take possession. Tries to get it to Kadri. That was such a solid collision. A moment or so ago, I, I'm not surprised to see that he's going to get some help at the bench here. The Sharks looking against the half wall. That's a really good save. I think the goalie's probably surprised he was dead center and open to shoot that puck. San Jose's got a hold of the puck. Moves it on over to the bank. Picked up along the wall by Richard. Quebec's got it against the boards. Cuts to the front. Denies him with the blocker. What a stop by the ball. Now, this is a good save here, James. I mean, he's got to read the play to get into position to make this stop. A difficult one from the slot. Almost lost the puck, but hangs on here as play continues. Quick feed to Nylander. And some smart heads-up defensive play by LeBanc. Takes the feed at center from the right wing. No quarter given here as they battle for the loose puck along the boards. Quick pass to Ovechkin. Quebec's got the puck against the half wall. Skate save! And the puck stopper jumps on top of it to get a stoppage in play. Robinson's still trying to shake off the effects of this hit. He really took a thump there. the midway mark of the frame. James and Ray with you tonight. 4-1 is where we sit. A pretty one-sided affair. Gretzky's won the face-off deep inside the offensive zone. We got a whistle. Penalty coming up. Well, what else goes wrong here? I mean, you're playing poorly, you're way behind, and now you're shorthanded. Itself off here. First opportunity tonight. The Sharks take possession off the faceoff and tries to make a diagonal pass to Hensus. Oh, and that's poked away in the offensive zone by Nylander. Quebec's got the puck along the boards. Back in the net, they score! I like the way they use that manpower advantage to their advantage. They move the puck quickly. That penalty killer just couldn't catch up. James, when they look at the film tomorrow, that's not going to look very good. That's a pretty bad air that led to that goal against. Quebec's been lighting the lamp all night long thus far, and it continues here in the second. Domination. Goals almost at every turn. Hey, buddy, you need to put your controller down. This is not fair. Nice speed from the left side up the middle. And that gets turned aside. The Markov fought that puck all night long. He makes a good save there, James, but... It's been a long night for him, and the guys in front of him haven't been much better. Can't make it work. Nice pass. Moves it quickly over to Nylander. Poked away at center by Blake. Oh, wow. That had 
some hot sauce on that collision. Did it ever, James. I mean, you could see he was raring to get a hit in to try and change a little bit of the momentum, and the shoulder went into the player. That's a solid, clean hit. Getting into the later stages of this period, Quebec's latest goal has now given them a four-goal lead. Clark's gained possession inside the neutral zone. Here's an odd man rush. It's a two-on-one. And he regains control of the puck. And now it's grabbed by Anderson. Oh, and that's got the crowd buzzing after that stop. Anderson's time in the penalty box is done if after that fight. Now he can get back to playing hockey here. This is what he does, and he should be able to generate some chances tonight. Both teams gliding into position, and the official set to drop the puck. Clark's got it, and they'll go on the attack here in the offensive zone. Sensational stop by the puck. Aggressive stop out on top of the crease to make the save on a dangerous chance. Oh, he'd like to have that pass back. And that'll bring an end to the second period of play. Let's get a clean sheet of ice and come back with the third period next. Changes things going forward. Thanks for the update, Ray. Quebec's got him along the wall. Puck scooped up by Couture. There's a solid collision. Nice feed. Picked up along the board. By and he's got the answer for that one. Whoa. Scores! Finally! I don't know how much better that's going to make them feel. I mean, they've given up so many here. The Sharks still have a lot of catching up to do, but they have something to build on now. Yeah, they do, and I think what they can look forward to is the buzzer is closer to the ah, end of the game. Oh, you went there, huh? Puck is dropped, and play resumes. From the left side, takes it at center. Scores! And there it is! 20 goals makes you feel like you've had a pretty consistent season. That's a good number for him to achieve. this talk on a string. Most guys wrap the string around their old feet. This guy dangles his way through, loses the defender, and then puts it in the net. A beauty. Quebec's added to their lead here in this third period. It's been non-stop. I like how they've scored and then gone after the next one, James. They've had their foot down on the gas pedal the whole night. Gretzky's won the draw here in the open ice. Off the left wing and into center. Gretzky's had a great game. He's already got three points and really been dynamic. Nabokov's going to slow things down and up for the whistle. Well, you got to kill the play eventually. That way everyone can get reorganized. The centermen glide into position. Gretzky's won the draw. Here's the chance to set up now. Solid hit on the play. Slides into Domi. He's down on the ice. Their trainer is already standing on top of the boards. It looks like he's going to come over and help them as soon as they blow this down. Gretzky's going to try and shake this off and get back into the game, but he took a heavy hit there. climbing out of a hole, but it's not very pretty right now. Hanzus has won it here at center. Oh, look who gets 
Just take it out on the play. Uh, I think a little retribution there, James. I mean, he threw that hit earlier, injured a player. He scores! They've given themselves a little bit of a chance here, James. Just opened the door for a little light. Can they find another one to really make it close? Something to build on, right, Razor? You just got to have something to believe in. This is it. Good heads up play to sneak in there on the tie up and come up with the puck. Quebec's got a hold of it against the wall. Slides it quickly to Nylander. And couldn't find the intended receiver on that one. And a good solid hit on that play. Puts the puck on net. Oh, he gets a blocker on it. What a stop by Lopez. Another crash. No surprise here, James. He's been doing this since about 7 o'clock tonight, time after time. Picking up steam in the offensive zone. And makes the save. The Sharks gain control of the puck. Campbell swinging the puck through center ice. Moves it to the middle. These games are fun for everyone, but if you're supposed to produce stars, you get one, you get hungry for a second one. Even if you're not a goal scorer, you get that early. Now you want to hunt for a second goal. Makes it a double on the play. And I love watching the way that he handles the pockets. Everything's a little fake, a little head shake, a little shoulder move. Now he's in the clear, he's got some room, and it's in the net. Quebec's all smiles on the bench next to you, aren't they? Yeah, they're having lots of fun. Not so much on the other side, where this night has been a nightmare. Good read by the winger as the two setters tie up. Moves it to Couture. And now he moves it to LeBay. And that's blocked in traffic. Feeds it down low. Here's a short pass to Hurley. From one point man to another. Grabbed along the board by Hurley. They are really buzzing here in the offensive end. Dished off to Hurley. There's a hit on the play. Oh, clutch save right there. Now it's picked. He's got the puck along the wall. Oh, it looks like the trainer's going to meet him at the door here. He's struggling to get off the ice, just trying to get to the bench. Kadri's been in some discomfort since he took this hit, a clean hit, right through the body. And the centers glide towards the dot here as we got a face-off set to go. Bergeron's won the draw here, and they'll go on the attack. And misses over the net. He looks like he's trying to go right under the bar. He just elevates that a little bit too much. So close, yet so far. Scooped up along the wall by Domi. And the final seconds ticking away here in regulation. And that was out the player. The Sharks will take the puck from behind the net. Oh, it serves up a little too sweet with that save. Oh, he had to get up tight to the puck. In close, he takes away any room. Oh, off the iron! Quebec's banged about three or four shots off the goalposts tonight. They've actually kind of lost count, but at least they have the lead. From behind the net. And he takes a shot, and he gets a piece of that one and denies it. Ahead of steam now towards the front. Here he is with the backhander. And he makes the save on that play. He's been really good on these high danger chances, and here's another one right from the slot. But he's trying that puck to keep it in front of him and make the save. Steps inside the attacking zone down the left wing. There's the final horn sounding, putting this baby to rest. Coming into this game, this team was really confident. So to suspect them on the win, Harlem wasn't a stretch for them. They extend the streak. Well, the way they're playing, it looks like that streak's not going to show an end anytime soon. Well, an encouraging start to the new year, as I know my broadcast partner, Ray Farrell, has yet to break his New Year's resolution. Not sure if he actually has it, but from all of us here, 